Memories. What's up, Emily? What's up, Emily? Today, gonna be bringing you. What's up, guys? The Emily TV here, and today we are, in fact, bringing you a Liga BBVA or La Liga squad builder. And this team looks like really, really good. It's got some really, really good players in, and hopefully, <clears throat> you guys will enjoy it, and it plays very, very good. In goal, we have <clears throat> the absolute beast, that is Casillas, 89 rated. He hasn't actually played this season because he got a broken wrist, so they bought uh, Diego Lopez. Because they have so much money, they can just splash out when they want. But Casillas is 89 rated, he's got 91 diving. 83 handling, 69 kicking, 85 positioning, and 92 reflexes. 6 foot 1 and 46 and a half grand. What a tank. In left back, we have Fabio Contral, Portuguese Real Madrid absolute machine. He has got 82 pace, 77 heading, and 78 defending. 5 foot 10, 80 dribbling, 74 passing, 1,700 coins absolute machine in the first right back spot we have <clears throat> Joe P Pereira he's 80 rated he's got 86 pace 76 defending 67 heading 77 passing and 78 dribbling um, he's a player that he has bought over Dani Alves because Dani Alves costs like 90 grand and Pereira it, he's still really good right back he only costs 1,400 coins, and <clears throat> I'd rather get him over Danny Alves because paying like 90 grand for a right back is only a fucking right back, so it's ridiculous. And especially if you've got these two centre backs that are PK and fucking Sergio Ramos, you are completely sorted. PK has got 62 pace, 76 passing, 81 heading, and 86 dribbling. So dribbling, defending. He's six foot four, so he's an absolute machine in the air, and he looks really, really tall. So from corners, you are lethal, <clears throat> and he only cost us five thousand one hundred coins. Like in this team, the player ratings are really high, and they're really good, and they don't cost that much coins. Like Casillas used to cost like over a hundred grand, and so did Ramos, and Ramos is only sixty two thousand. Sorry, 62,500. But Ramos has got 79 pace, 88 heading, and 84 defending. He's only 6 foot, so he's quite small. I always thought he's a bit taller than that, but he's got 75 passing and 72 dribbling. And also, just to add it in, he's got 61 shooting. He's a really attackive centre back. And again, he cost us 62,500 grand. But in the first centre mid spot, we have the 90 rated Xavi. Xavi has got 66 pace, 73 shooting, 93 passing, <clears throat> and 87 dribbling. He is 5 for 7, so he's an absolute midget, and he costs us 31,250 coins. And he is an absolute machine of a centre mid. <clears throat> My voice has like, gone really, really weird, the it's gone really croaky. <clears throat> but Xavi, he's, with his 93 passing, he can ping a ball from... The halfway across the pitch is such a machine. In other centimeter spot, we have 87 eight, rated Xavi Alonso. 58 pace, 88 passing, <clears throat> 75 shooting, and 71 dribbling, and 81 defending. So he's, he's, he's a good player, but he's only got two star skills. What's really, really annoying for a skiller and like me who just abuses the chops and really for the four star skills, and he only costs us three and a half grand. In the left mid spot, we have Iniesta. Iniesta is another one, one of, another one of them players who's 90 rated, and it only costs 34 grand. And like, yeah, it's still quite a lot, but he's 90 rated. It used to be over 100 grand, but Iniesta has got 75 pace, <coughs> 72 shooting, 91 passing, and 91 dribbling. Five for seven, four star skills, four star week for 34 grand. What a motherfucking tank! And in the right spot, <coughs> right mid spot, we have uh, Di Maria. Di Maria, I always thought he had 91 pace, but he's got 90 pace. I swear he's had 91 pace. 
What the fuck? That's that is quite strange. He's only got two star weak foot and four star skills, so that's really annoying. But he's got 90 pace, 79 shooting, 82 passing, and 87 dribbling. 5 foot 11, 6,300 coins. I'm quite annoyed about his um his weak foot, but hopefully he'll still be a good player. Let's, let's go for the the team of the season, and that will be Ruben Castro. Yes, I actually got it right. Come on. Ruben Castro is a team of the season, most consistent. He is apparently, according to a beast subscriber called Killer Candy Force 97, apparently he's really, really good. So hopefully he can be. He actually cost us 43 and a half grand, so hopefully he fucking can be. He's got 86 pace, 80 shooting, and 82 dribbling, and 70 heading. 3 star skills, 3 star weak for 5 foot 9. What a machine. <coughs> he looks really cool as well, so. Hopefully he can be. I've actually got a really dry throat, so I'm going to have a cheeky drink. Where's that? Ugh. Oh, fucking hell. That's gone all over my fucking trousers. Jesus fucking Christ. Oh, my God. In the other striker's part, we have Falco, the upgraded version. Oh, my pants are so fucking wet. Jesus Christ. Ew, uh, he is 89 rated and he cost 15 grand. Like, what the hell? His upgraded version cost 15 grand. He's got 79 pace, 85 shooting and 91 heading and 80 dribbling. But a stat that looks has annoyed me quite a lot. Jesus Christ, he's got a 5-star weak fan, 4-star skills. He has got 59 passing. And you guys probably don't know this, but I really hate it when strikers don't have really bad passing. But he's got 91 heading and he's 5 foot 9. He's got very, very good jumping. <clears throat> but again, he cost us 15,250 coins. I hope you guys have a back and enjoy this episode. Stay tuned, part 2 of the goals. And just look at the team. And it's, oh, it only, by the way, it only cost us 200 and I think it's 50 grand. I think. Don't. Correct me on that. I think it's like 250. I think. I think it's 240 actually. I enjoyed it. Give a like. Plus, go. Cheers, guys.